What we're looking at here is a new option available from Marvin. Today it's available on casement windows, awning windows, sliding doors, and swinging doors. Uh, we'll soon be available on a new double hung product we're coming out with. They're calling it an integrated shade system. By that, what we've done here is we've integrated the frame or the surround of the shade into the design or the profile of our window. Quite often when you think about window treatment applications, they're installed after the fact and are mounted on the outside or the trim of the window and typically tend to conceal some of that nice millwork that has been done in trimming out the window. So this shade system that we have here is a top-down, bottom-up uh, operating system, meaning I can either lower the pleat from the top, or if we wanted to drop the top part of that down, we can do that as well. One of the nice features is it operates independently of the sash, mm -hmm. meaning that, so if we operate this window to get some ventilation, we're still able to control light and privacy. It's available in 15 different color options for the fabric, including five that are considered blackout, mm -hmm. meaning if this was our home theater and we didn't want to have any light, we could choose one of those blackout uh, fabric options. We match the interior of the window to the shade accessories. So in this case, we have a fur interior on our window and our surround for the shade and the shade operating handles are also in the fur species. Okay. Um, Marvin's doing things today like pre-staining and pre-finishing. If we chose those options on the windows, those would be carried through on our shade option as well. Okay. And the screen is a pop-out screen, right? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. The screen happens to be integrated right into the surround. But like, let's say in the winter time, a lot of people uh, want to lose the screen. We can quite simply remove the uh, shade option here. Yeah. We pop that out, and we can independently remove that screen, and then put the shade right back in place, so that we still have the ability the ability to control light and privacy. We've just simply removed our screen now, and we still have the ability to operate the shade for light and privacy. Okay, well, thanks, Ben. Uh, appreciate your time. Thank you. Yep.